Hi, this is Jennifer from Daily Wonder. I wanted to share with you a little bit about a lesser known festival that we at Daily Wonder love to celebrate on February 2nd or the weekend just coming up to that. Uh, in our current modern days, we typically know of Groundhog Day, which is looking to the groundhog to see whether it sees its shadow or not and to know whether winter is going to be an extended period or whether spring is coming soon. But this tradition is um, dates back to Candlemas, which was a, a Christian tradition, and before that, a pagan tradition celebrating Imbolc, the goddess of the dawn. And it's really, it's marking this halfway point between the winter solstice and the spring equinox. So it's a quarter part of the year and it is halfway on its way to spring. And we want to know whether spring is coming. And so there were all kinds of traditions of looking to the weather. You know, if it's sunny on that day, winter is going to last a long time. If it's raining on that day, good news, spring is coming quickly. So um, a traditional activity is candle dipping because in our ancient times, of course, our ancestors didn't have electricity and they didn't have the luxury of having lights on, you know, once it got dark outside. So you really needed a lot of candles or you had to, you know, make sure you didn't use them up too much. So halfway through this winter, you could make a new batch of candles to get you through until spring. So we loved having um, in our school uh, a pot of beeswax that you've melted in an old tin pot of some sort. Some people like to do it outside on a Coleman stove and you get the long strings as your wicks and we would circle around and around and create this beautiful reverent space where it's just singing that's carrying the children and the adults around. And um, it's just, you know, thinking about this time, enjoying this celebration together and doing something practical as well and ending up with these beautiful beeswax uh, candlesticks at the end. So the key piece of it is this song. Songs always hold space, you know, in festivals. And um, I'm going to share a song with you that you could learn and sing. It's very simple and short, and then it's meant to be going around and around and around, and you sing it and sing it and sing it until your candles have reached the thickness and length that you want. and around and around and around. Have fun.